I, I love to uh, work on the jumble or the crossword puzzle, any of the puzzles in the uh, newspaper. That's what I do for the first hour of my morning every day of my life now. It's the moment of discovery. You know, aha, I see it. When, when I was a graduate student, we were just beginning to work out the genetic code. And I was, I, I was really tickled to death by the experiments that, uh, that people were doing to determine what the code was. And I was fascinated. I was, I was gone. My, uh, I fell in love, is the best I can say. The, the paper presented by this uh, student in my class claimed that genes were transferred from agrobacterium to these plant cells. I didn't believe a word of it. I know how to solve the problem, the puzzle of uh, whether there is gene transfer between agrobacterium and those plants. I just wanted to settle the science in my own mind. The evidence that we got came from a huge experiment that involved the entire laboratory team. We, we dubbed it the brute force experiment because we, we, uh, we had to work around the clock for about three days. I was blown away by the finding that there, there appeared to be gene transfer. We had to perform the experiment repeatedly because this, the outcome was so surprising. The feeling that that engendered amongst the team members was, uh, was something very special. We've looked for it in other places and other times later in our careers, but nothing has ever really been quite the same. The population is projected to increase from 7 billion people globally to 9 billion by mid-century. It's a lot of people, a lot of people to feed. It is my heartfelt hope that we will see acceptance of this technology in my lifetime. I'm getting old. I'm going to get busy.